listen, I'm going to be here the next couple of months. Chop it up. Press down like that. I haven't got a clue what I'm supposed to be doing. We need to get our stuff on. That is what I'm talking about. Twist like that, give it a ruddy good spanking. Perfect. Just having a moment. Egg fried rice, it's an absolute classic. And I've got a recipe for you that is so consistent and delicious, quick and easy. So it starts with a big pan on a high heat. And I've got six beautiful spring onions here that I'm gonna finely slice. I absolutely love making this recipe. Yes, you could do this as a side dish, no trouble at all. But actually, it's heading towards being a really beautiful dinner. So finely slice this up. And as this pan gets nice and hot, I'm going to go in with one tablespoon of olive oil and I'm going to go straight in with the onions and we'll get them sizzling straight away. And then I've got some packet pre-cooked rice. Yes, you can cook your own rice, white rice, 12 minutes, but for stir-fried rice, you have to drain it and chill it. You cannot stir-fry hot rice. This pre-cooked shortcut will stop your egg-fried rice going sticky. So for me, that feels like a good cheat. You can hear it sizzling. You know, we're sort of jiggling it around. So it's fast, it's hot, it's furious. We're just going to toss it around. Right, the next ingredient. I have this in my home all the time now, chilli jam. It's brilliant for cooking. It's got heat, but it's also got the sweetness and it's going to kind of glaze and help you balance flavours. So two nice teaspoons go in to our pan and then just start tossing again. And immediately, that will start to coat every single rice grain, and it will shine in the most beautiful way. And then just give it a little splash of water, just to kind of help plump up that lovely rice. At this stage, just push the rice up the side of the pan, like that. And then straight into the middle, we're going to crack in two beautiful free-range eggs. I just want to have it there like a fried egg and then just break it and have it marbled. So we're really celebrating the egg whites and the egg yolks. And then it's time for the last ingredient, which again, to a lot of people, is a bit of a new ingredient. Tofu. Firm, silken tofu. It's protein, basically. It's made out of soya beans. It's extremely healthy. But let me just show you what's in here. What you end up with is like a little slab of tofu. Uh, we just need half of that, about 150 grams. And what you can do is just break this up. And then as that cooks, then we can start just bringing the rice back in. But I want chunks of tofu, and I want little bits, and I want chunks of egg, and I want little bits. So the nice thing about this stir-fried rice is it's kind of random. Season with a little salt, give it a little toss to mix it all up, and then we're ready to serve. Get a bowl, put a little oil around the bowl, give it a rub. We're going to make sandcastles, basically, but we're going to make it with stir-fried rice. Just pour your rice in here. Stir-fried rice dishes and that kind of street food, which is beautiful. It's often associated with being unhealthy. This has been made to be healthy. So push it down, and then we're ready to turn it out. Let me just get our plate, put it on top, apply a little bit of pressure, turn it up. I just kind of like it. So there you go. Fantastic stir-fried rice for two people. And you could have that as a side, you could have that as a meal. I think it's the time to have a little taste up. And like every good sandcastle, at some point, someone has to come and destroy it. In this case, me. And I love that kind of whole caught egg with then the fluffy, juicy rice on the inside. Mm. Really beautiful. There's heat there. The onions have still got a nice little crunch. And the tofu's so silky and delicious. Looks fantastic. And it's really good fun to make. 